This is code.org. Let's see what we're doing. Now make your make something on your own. What happens when you make two separate circles of different stickers? Uh, okay, so we talked about what the circles and the degrees were in the last section. So if you're not sure, go watch that tutorial. But okay, so we're going to make two different loops, right? Because that's how we were making our circle. And then I'm going to droop and droop, pick some stickers. Uh, I'll do something new, like a unicorn and a dog. Now, this isn't going to work. I just draw the same thing on top of each other. Okay. So keep in mind, we do want to move forward. Uh, we do want to jump to the center again. And I'm going to put it up here because I'm going to be jumping around too. So let's, uh, we'll only need to do it once. Once. So I'm going to put that here and here. And then let's try, and again, you can be wrong, you can make mistakes, you can hate what you do in code, you can test things a bazillion times. So, that's what I'm doing. 60, so this is what they gave us last time, 6 and 60, and I'm going to do 4 and 90, and no idea what it will look like. Whoa, that was super fast. Okay, so let's go ahead and I'm going to jump, ah, reset. Like we did last time, not jump, remember we moved forward, so I'm going to in between jump to center i'm going to move forward 100 pixels let's actually do 50 i'm going to then draw the dog and then i'm going to move backwards 50 I'm loving this. Um, okay. And then let's change this from, I want to go around 36 times on this one. And I'm only going to move by 10 degrees. Actually, let's do 18 and 20. And so what we're looking for here, by the way, is we're making sure this equals 360. All right, let's try that out. Yes. Now I want to set a pattern. Actually, notice the horse is underneath the dog. Well, that's because code runs in order. So my horse is drawn first. I want the horse to be able to be seen. So I just switch these up. Now with my lines, I want my lines to be, well, longer. 80 and 80. And I'm going to pick a pattern because you only need to pick the pattern once. You don't need to tell the computer 18 times what your pattern is. You can put it up here somewhere. Notice how I draw, I run through this entire loop, and then once I'm done, I draw the horse. But, uh, it's art. I kind of, okay. Now with the horse, what if I did, I just can't not. I'm going to set a pattern out of the loop, because we only need to set it once. And then I'm going to go... Move forward 100, move backwards 100. Let me put jump to center up here just in case. Let's give this a try. Oh, is it hidden by the horse? Oh, yeah, it's there. Awesome. My art. Okay, I just can't stop now. I want it to go off screen. <laughs> Perfection. I hope yours is as awesome as mine. I'm sure it is. Onward.